believe I'm actually getting a lesson here taught by Royal. I know, this place is amazing. Do you see all these horse stalls? All these horses are treated like world champions. Oh my god, it's really you! You're amazing! I can't believe it's really you! Woo! Welcome to a very special event. Our first multi-generational training lesson. You'll be taught how to attack the jumps, how to move in the way that signals your rider what you're going to do. It is all about the communication and fearless attitude. Now who was ready to get started? So first, everyone, show me what you got. Who wants to go first and start off at our beginner special fall jump? I am watching how you move your body across the jump. You approach it with an eagerness and confidence to go over it. After everyone goes, you will break up into two groups. people and I'll work with them for half the time and the rest of you I would like to go for you to go get a snack in the field and enjoy your time and prepare for the rest of the time with me okay well you all did great I'm going to choose you 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 and you now most of you are new to jumping and we want you to know that all of us have been there. It's gonna take some time. Chili, please stop for it. Some of you may wonder why Chili's here with us, but Chili is here to help you along. Chili, you jumped wonderfully, and I'm surprised that you put your application that you have never jumped before. Thanks, Royal. I was so nervous, but I was also ex so excited at the same time. I've always dreamed of soaring through the wind over a jump and to be here where all the great horses have lived and trained is amazing. I am so excited to be here. But I do have one question. What is that weird house over there? Do you have any stories about it? I was wondering who was going to ask first about this. So let's take a minute together and I can tell you the exhilarating Sad story about the Pedigo family. Maximus, that was terrible. Do that jump again. You must be the best. You are the champion. The world expects perfection out of you. Not one muscle out of place. Not one twitch. Every step has to be the best, always. Again, Maximus! I am going to get your rider. You better start jumping well. Are you trying to hurt every rider I put on you? What is your problem? I don't care that this is your seventh day in a row training. I don't care if we are out here for hours every day. You will be the best. My entire career as a trainer is on your shoulders. And you will not let me down or you will regret it. Get me another rider. This one is not working out. Then do it again. Honey, are you worried about how hard he's working on Maximus? Do you think they're pushing him too far? He's already the current world champion. What else do they want from him? He will be fine. The Olympics are in three weeks, and he must win and beat every record. I sure hope you are right. I will not be okay if something happens to my boy. Maximus, again. Do it again. I have taught you how to jump, and I expect you to do exactly as you are told. <laughs> uh. 
Are you pretending that your hoof hurts? I know it does not. That will not get you out of practice. Now do it again! Are you sure he's okay? You want me to take a look? Not until practice is done. Come back in two hours. Sir, the two hours are done now. One more time, you wimp Maximus, and then you can come and see the doctor. I'm so sorry, Maximus. You need rest. Your ankle is very swollen. Here's some medicine, and I will talk to your trainer. Now you can go see the rest of your family. Maximus, are you okay? You should not feel like this. You need to take a break. Rest would be good for you. I will be okay, Mom. He is a champion. He'll train like one. He'll be fine. Again! That was terrible! I told you he needed a break. What is he doing out here? You give him medicine to make him feel better. I determine when and how often he trains. This treatment to Maximus continued for three more weeks up until the Olympics. His mother, Beauty, a past champion herself, was tortured watching them train her only child, her only son, this way. Now his dad was all for the training, seeing he never made it as a champion. He was never good enough, and wasn't even good enough to be a lesson horse. His life he worked as a trail ride horse, the worst possible job for a horse, and he wanted his son to be the best. Then, the, the, the night before the Olympics, the unthinkable happened. When Maximus did not come after his lesson, his mom, Beauty, went looking for him. She found him in the arena, dead. She screamed and cried for help, and no one came. She stayed in the arena all night with her dead son. The next morning, the trainer showed up to take Maximus to the Olympics, but it was greeted instead by a mother, horse, gone mad. She trampled him to death. She said she went crazy that day, never left the house, except at night she would come out to the arena and weep for her son. This took place over 50 years ago. And horses today still say her spirit still comes out to weep for her son. No one has been daring enough to go into their homes since that dreadful night. Does that answer everyone's questions? Now, we must start on our lesson because no one wants to be on the arena after dark. Uh-huh, yeah, yeah. Thank you for all your participations in today's events. I can see some real champions forming in some of you, and I am excited for your future. Those of you who have made it past today's lesson will get a special invitation to our next one. So, do you guys want to go on an adventure? Let's go to the house. I don't believe in ghosts. I don't know. I'm totally in. Let's go. just go in let's just go in it's not like anyone lives here wow this place is just as creepy inside as it is outside this place is awesome uh, i don't know about this anymore i think i see something moving over there doing in here does this place look like a playground get out or i will do to you what i did to the others who think they are welcome here oh my god i'm ah! ah!
on that train's here will know what it feels like to lose the best horse they know. I will never leave. Be afraid. Be very afraid. <laughs>